Alright guys, welcome back. Let's keep going. Okay, so we just rescued the four eggs that the pirates have captured. So we gotta save the last three. Now, in order to even get to them, we're gonna need some help. <laughs> now, this is who we're gonna need help from, this little seahorse. I sure am. As a matter of fact, I do. Alright, we got the seahorse. Take you to the waters near Pinnacle Rock. Okay. See those two big rocks over there that form like a gateway? That's where we're heading. Okay, so welcome to Pinnacle Rock. Let's let this guy out. Now, make sure to follow this guy very carefully. Because around this area, there's a bunch of invisible tides, and only he can see them. This is why we needed to get the seahorse. If you get swept up in a tide, you'll be taken right back to the start. Ah, uh, the pirates were talking about sea snakes. Alright, we'll find your friend. Alright, now, for those of you who played Super Mario 64, if you thought the eels in that one level were scary, wait till you see these things. Now, you can only hurt him with your magic barrier, and the only way to lure him out is to go right in front of the cave. Okay, there's a Zora egg. I believe there should be seven of these guys in total.
There's your friend. Another heart piece. Now you'll only find your the seahorse's friend if you kill all the snakes in this area. Just leave now and end up back at Great Bay. Okay, back to the lab. Last door. You gotta make sure that you save all seven Zora eggs in one cycle, otherwise you gotta do it all over again. <laughs> it's going 
to start. Okay. Hey, all right, they hatch. Looks like they're all healthy. Wave Bossa Nova. Alright, so we now have our way to the next temple open. But we're not, as usual, we're not going to be going there just yet. Oh yeah, be careful here at night time. There's a bunch of like likes. This like like only comes out at night, and it drops a heart piece when you kill it. Now that we have the hook shot, we can actually get up to the second level here.
exactly color is green. I wonder why. Okay, let's talk to Jabba's now. We're gonna have a jam session with him. Jappus has a point. Evan's a very jealous person, and he won't accept music written by other members of the band. However, if you play it as a someone who's not part of the band... So let's give it a shot. Unfortunately, he's going to take all the credit for that song. But it's the only way to get this heart piece. He doesn't deserve that song. Of course they do, jerk. Alright guys, that's going to be it for now. See you next time.